So the important thing for many people of years ago, not necessarily now, because we have athletic races going up the mountain, but the pilgrimage was the important thing. And you didn't need to have organized church, you know, maybe, maybe services on the mountain. What you needed was the stations. So if one starts in Murrisk, and we join, join the tour of Orig coming from the east here, the first station is called Lac de And it's, it tells us in the Book of Amah that when Patrick arrived in Murrisk, his charioteer died in Murrisk. And it's believed his name was Toth Wheel, which is the bald one. But Patrick's assistant, who became the Archbishop of Armagh after Patrick, was called Binnam. So we believe this is dedicated to the second, Arch second Archbishop of Armagh. Mm. This is Castle Porrick, which is Patrick's way. <coughs> and on the summit you have St. Patrick's Oratory, Lava Porrick, and Chapel Porrick. It's that is the second station. And the third station is just on the crest here again. It's called Relic Guerra and Gary Moore. Relic is, is, is uh, Mary's graveyard. And uh, this is the third station. I think, though, certainly in the last 50 years, most people climb the route of Morris, go to the summit and back down again. I would say there are very few mountain people who fully understand the, the stations of the reek. Another important side is Glosh Patrick, because this is where we believe that Patrick buried Toth Wheel, his ch charioteer. And it is written in the Book of Ramah that he will come here on the last day of the earth. So if ever you hear of the nuclear bombs going off or whatever, I would say it's, it's going, to be as good, it's going to be as good as best as any to go out. <laughs> okay, so as I say, starting out on the pilgrimage to the mountain, you have a sign that clearly says there are three stations. Not been on the summit, I'm really aware. Many people think that the statue that was erected in 1932 um, is the first station. It really is the start of the pilgrimage, the finish of the pilgrimage, and the ideal meeting place. But it is not an official station. But it's no harm that they, that they go around here saying some prayers. Of course, when you start doing the pilgrimage on Reef Sunday, you will meet many, many interesting characters. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> here's just one, for example. Okay. So, at this stage, it, you know, the, climber, the climbers are coming up the mountain. You will see quite a few people in bare feet. Now, I've been studying this mountain I would say for 25 years. I've never seen a woman in bare feet until last year. And not only did I see one, but I saw three of them. So it, so it seems to be sort of a male thing that they do it with their bare feet. Why do they do it with their bare feet? They believe they're walking on sacred ground. So if we take the Muslims, they take off their shoes going into the temple. And uh, it's all religious sites going back many years. They, the belief was that it was sacred ground. Modern people think it is penance. No, it, it, you know, I disagree. I don't think there's any mention in history of saying that you, that you climb this mountain in your bare feet because of penance. So as I said, you get to the crest, I don't know how it takes the time, and uh, you have locked pen on. So you have to do seven rounds saying seven Our Fathers, seven Hail Marys, and seven Glory Bees going around this, always going around clockwise. This is the traditional way of doing a station. From this, once you're finished, you're then facing into the very steep side of the mountain. And of course we meet, meet our friend again on the way up. <laughs> and this is the last part of Cosm Park, which is, which is a very difficult climb for a lot of people. And once you enter the summit, you, you would read the sign here, the summit which is the second station. And it tells you what to do. It says, to kneel, it says, seven Our Fathers, seven Hail Marys and one Creed, pray Near the chapel for the Pope's intention, walk 15 times around the chapel. Again, you walk around clockwise, uh, saying 15 Our Fathers, 15 Hail Marys, and one creed. And then walk seven times around Lava Porrick, saying seven Our Fathers, seven Hail Marys, and one creed. And then you go down the west side of the mountain to the third station, and you have finished the station of Crow Patrick. <laughs>